Hi folks, Joe here. Today I'm at Questacon's Makerspace, but I recently travelled to Brisbane to chat with Taj Pabari, a local teenager that's rethinking how we interact with smart devices. Let's check it out. At the time when I started this company, I was 13 and a half years old, co-founder at the time had just turned 18. So we weren't too technologically literate, we didn't know how to design a computer, we'd never done that stuff before, so it was a steep learning curve. It was just all about surrounding ourselves with people who had been there, done that along the hardware sort of chain, making sure that we were meeting people who had designed pieces of hardware from the ground up. What we were doing wasn't the um, most conventional piece of hardware. What we were doing was something that was going to go into the hands of children. So we had to make something that was super safe, something that was super fun and quite aesthetically pleasing as well. So they start off with building their very own tablet computer. It's an Android tablet after it's built. They clip in the battery, they clip in the the camera, the flex cables, etc. Then they jump onto the tablet, it's an Android tablet, they program a game, learn through visual programming, that sort of thing, and then we've got a whole curriculum on computer science. So actually take them through, hey, what does the screen do? What does the battery do? What does the camera do? And we go right into the inner depth um, in terms of what these individual components do as well. Digital literacy skills over the past three years have increased by I think 212% um, in the workplace. So, what we're trying to do is bridge that gap and ensuring, um, ensure all young people, no matter where they're from, regardless of their age or knowledge base, they are properly digitally literate. They understand how to build computers, they understand what computers do, rather than just using and consuming one. The second thing is entrepreneurship. We wanted to give young people um, that opportunity to um, engage in the world of entrepreneurship, engage their creative mindset problem solve, critical thinking, um, skills that we know are quite important for success in this day and age, um, bring that to them from a very young age as well. And then I think the third thing um, is, is creativity. Our name 56 um, in numerology means opportunity and we wanted to give young people the opportunity to build tech, create tech um, and immerse themselves with tech. So we go into communities and communities overseas to India, to Nepal, regions of Asia and regions of Africa to donate our tablet computers, um, do a few workshops to get them actually learning 21st century teachings using 21st century technology as well. So my general advice for young people still in high school or university is look, give it your all in those traditional sort of systems. If you feel you have the capacity, you have the motivation and the mindset to actually start during high school or start during university, start then you've got the ability to wake up at whatever time you want to wake up or go to sleep or whatever time you want to go to sleep. There's that quote, if you have the passion, take the action, the magic will happen. So it's just about making sure you take the opportunity to learn from your mistakes and experience everything. Um, yeah, just live life um, to its fullest.